health officers in all nine Bay Area counties urged people to begin wearing masks again indoors or at large gatherings. But as KPIX 5's John Ramis reports, many people are making their own decisions this time around. COVID-19 is still here, but the rules have been relaxed and a lot of the fear is gone. So we came to this car show to find out how people are feeling these days about the pandemic. A fever used to keep you out of events, but at the Niles Spring Fever Car Show, it's almost a requirement. Here, people come from all over to view the unique, the antique, and the one of a kind, like this 1941 Lincoln Continental, one of only 300 ever made. The annual car show is so popular that when the pandemic hit in 2020, people brought their cars even after the city canceled the event. Well, we couldn't close off the street. We couldn't get the city involved. We couldn't do whatever. So the people staged their yeah, own car show? Yeah, pretty much. And so all of a sudden, everybody's like, you know what? You're finally doing it. Here we are. So the car show is back with more entries than ever. But take a look at the crowd, and it's hard to find anyone wearing a mask. The fear of COVID is pretty much gone. Even for Eddie Zakursky, who has a heart condition and has already gotten COVID once before. I just don't think it's that big a deal. It looks like you got a lot of company out here who feel that way. You look around, you one in what, a hundred has a mask on? Officially, the county recommends that people mask up at large outdoor gatherings, but it's not required. The Bay Area currently has a 10% positivity rate, three times the statewide average, but few here seem very worried about it. Franco Pietroforte thinks it's just another flu and doesn't believe the vaccines work anyway. If there was a vaccine that really worked, we wouldn't have it to be gone, right? Yeah. Like the typical ones, right? So well, not if people don't take the vaccine. Well, that's true too, but then you can probably form an immunity to that. Yeah, I, mean, I know that's that's, that's called that's holiday called holiday getting the night. illness. <laughs> yeah, yeah, that, that's true. That could happen, yeah. yeah. But I think right now most people are okay with it. But those who do mask up have different reasons for doing it. David Prakash works in a hospital. I mean, it's just a part of life now pretty much for us. I mean, you know, that work in the healthcare field, I mean, we feel naked without it. So. And his father-in-law, Edward Carrillo, has an unvaccinated one-year-old grandchild. We really got the mindset, like, this ain't over yet. There's still ways to go and kind of want to get back over that hump. We've been doing it for two years now, so why quit now? But along with the fear, something else is missing, the anger. Everyone seems willing to let the other guy make his own decision. And that feels pretty good to Kathy Palestro, who doesn't object to masks, but enjoys a day out without having to wear one. I don't think we're in danger now. Now, if the government, government was to come out and say, wear a mask, we'll wear a mask. But right now, it seems to be we're on our own. In Niles, John Ramos, KPIX 5.